to our first case she was a uh, uh, second gravida para one living one 28 years and she came at a period of gestation of 13 weeks her nt was normal as you can see it was 50th centile the normal nt is from 5th to 95th centile but her pap was low and free beta hcg was high and her first combined first trimester risk of downs was 1 in 57 so how do we proceed can we do a quadruple test no because quadruple test has a lower detection rate than the first trimester combined screening we can do a fully integrated test which has a higher detection rate of 95% can we do an nipt yes because in this case there is no structural abnormality the high risk is because of the biochemical imbalance due to low pap and high beta free beta hcg and nipt can be used as a secondary screening tool she has a risk of 1 in 57 so we risk greater than 1 is to 250 we take it as high risk high risk and we can you we usually advise for a invasive testing but if she doesn't agree then we can advise her to get a nip we can counsel her for nipt and nipt can reduce the incidence of invasive testing for 20 to 3 person so my first trimester screening i've already told you the is done between 11 to 13 weeks plus 6 days when the crl is 45 to 84 mm and here we take into consideration maternal age biochemical marker that is dual screen including free beta hcg and pap and nuchal translucency uh and then the risk is calculated and it has a very high detection rate of almost 90% with a false positive rate of 5% we can do additional tests like laser bone fetal heart rate monitoring tricuspid regurgitation and reverse a wave in depthus venosus which i'll be telling later in my talk which can increase this detection rate further Thank you.